the United States Light got signed today. I don't know if you saw that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we Rogue, East, Rogue Esports. That's a that's a really big org coming into Smash. Yeah. I like that. Good news. Mm. And two players that have made their rounds have been sponsored by plenty of orgs. All right, so this is uh, this is Dyer's Wolf versus Seth's Inkling. Dyer has an Inkling. He's like a wolf slash Inkling. I think he's trying to be more wolf than Inkling, mm -hmm. but uh, he knows his character very well. And Seth has the Inkling and the Yoshi as well. We've seen them both yep. on stream earlier today when he's playing against Nebula. Yeah, so we can see a few different matchups yeah. throughout this set. Is this best of five or best of three? Best this is best of three. three. Okay. Since this is only loser eight, mm -hmm. I assume it'll be loser semi when we get his best of five. A lot of fast gameplay here. You will be seeing a lot of combos coming off of the short hop for these characters. A lot of them operate really well in that low to the ground zone, but not exactly touching the ground quite yet. Yeah. Ooh. Whenever Wolf gets a trade, man, he just wins it. Yeah, well, Wolf <laughs> wins most trades. Yeah. Wolf does so, so much damage. He's the kid on the block to take your Yu-Gi-Oh cards. He's <laughs> he just wins all the trades. Yeah, by taking. By that's, taking. That's yeah. right. He, he gives takes nothing in return. Yeah. Middle platform here, mostly sitting under it, but Seth gonna find his way through that defense. Ooh, that side be the above the stage. Wanna go to ledge there? I, I doubt that that was where he wanted to end up, but it is where he ended up. Didn't it? Getting the up air out there, trying to get him at the ledge, but spacing that forward tilt. Ooh, the clank from roller to forward tilt. I haven't seen that. They, they actually uh, they nerfed the hitbox on, on, on the front of the roller. Yeah. So, I mean, I, at forward tilt, Wolf's forward tilt has such an enormous hitbox in front of it. It's very disjointed, so that's one of the moves that would have beat it even before the nerf, but a lot more moves in general can beat roller now. Yep. Ooh, got hit by the ink bomb there. Going to save his jump. Going to get right under that ledge and come up vertically. Using that middle platform, though, you're going to want to see either player, whoever's in the advantage, is going to be sitting under that with their shield. Ooh, where's the punish? That's not going to do it. Yeah, I was expecting an up, I expected an up smash when he shielded the roller, and then again when he shielded the up smash. But no dice. The up tilt, though, the, the discount snake going to come through and take out that stock. Dire. Ooh, stuck on the platform oh there. Caught jumping. Gosh, yeah. yeah. That up smash will call you. Yeah, Seth just he knew exactly where he was going. There was a very confident up smash. Really. I'll throw forward air, gonna catch the DI out. You saw him trying to maybe get to ledge there too, so the forward air is smart. You do see wolves go for up air at times when they're more middle of the stage. Up air, up air is good with wolf because, well, first of all, it's easy to follow up on, but more importantly, it does like 18 damage. Mm -hmm. Perfectly spaced. Bear's on shield here from Dyer. That you was, just keep it set to the ledge. That was really good. He yep. buried his shield and just walked away and dashed attack back. He has not gotten hit since that up smash. That was the last thing he was hit by. And he's put, he, the, the wall of attrition, yeah. man. Come on. <laughs> Uh, interesting Good. note is that the auto cancel window on Wolf's back air is the same as Fox's. Interesting. Yeah. Very interesting. Soft air though. He's, he's operating this middle stage well. The nice. up okay. angle up forward tilt. I meant forward tilt, yeah. yeah. Back throw. Yeah, not going to do it yet. Probably just want to maybe catch a DI mix up a little bit. Yeah, I mean, his other throws never kill. <laughs> right, so back yeah. throw, if, if there was one to kill, it'd be back throw. I mean, you might not want to stale it, but it is, like you said, it gets him. Mixes up the DI, it just kind of keeps him on the toes. Yep. Ooh, the dash I tag. Did you see dash tag a lot Speaking earlier, percent? That, uh, uh, any move where Wolf hits you with the blades on his feet. Gotta hurt. It hurts, man. Up tilt, dash tag, back air. Those moves hurt. Nair even. Mm -hmm. Nair does 50 damage. It does 10 damage if you get the sour spot. You trade that, that dash tag and then keep it. Seth low to the ground, get him that easy trade versus Dyer's Wolf. Yeah, Seth's just having, he's having a little bit of a hard time, honestly. I feel like uh, Dyer has maintained advantage for 70% of the set. And he, he's staying mobile, too. So he's, yeah. he's never staying in one place too long to where that Seth knows where he could be going. Yeah. Ooh, beautiful Nairs here, too. Extending the edge guard. Not going for the kill immediately. Going to get turned around here, though. I don't think that was the best guy. He's dead. Yeah. All right, got some life. What's Seth got for us? Yeah, Seth's amazing, so, you know. And Inkling's really good at racking up low damage, mm -hmm. or low percent damage. It's a good neutral air dodge by Dyer to get out of the situation. A lot, it seems like a lot of people kind of don't utilize neutral air dodge. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Dyer not staying mobile while he had Seth to the ledge there, so Seth had, had an idea where he's going to be. Yep. Back throw again. Getting stale, but going to keep him off the stage, too. Sets up for the, the edge guard situation. The laser kind of just negated any of the recovery mix-ups that Seth wanted to do right there. It stopped the... It kept him honest. Stopped the roller. It stopped the splat bomb. Got to stay mobile here. What you got for us? Ooh, that was beautiful. 
Yeah, Dyer just, I don't know, man. He, he seemed like he really knew everywhere Seth was going to go. <laughs> and Seth was getting his damage in, too, though. That's, that's, that's not the thing, but it just seemed like whenever there was, it was an advantage to be had, it was all Dyer. Yeah, there was. Uh, exactly. Seth was, he was never too far behind. It just seemed like everything that he got, he got off a little, like, little, little nicks here and there. Yeah. Whereas Dyer would have, like, really explosive damage. But it wouldn't, I don't think Seth, like, he wouldn't have to do too much more. He doesn't need to. It's nothing drastic mm -hmm. that he would need to do to make that a even game or even like a game that's in his favor. With how much you you see Wolf follow up uh, out of his like short hop aerial confirm, uh, short hop aerial confirms. Do you think Yoshi might be a play here with his like very very high aerial mobility? I am much worse than these guys, so <laughs> I want to you know put that out there first. But when I play Wolf, I think Wolf is a harder matchup for Wolf than than Inkling. Inkling mm -hmm. is a good character, almost definitely a better character, mm -hmm. but I like the Inkling matchup with Wolf much more than I like the Yoshi matchup. Yep. Mm -hmm. I, I don't know. I just feel like you can maybe drift in with a Nair a little bit faster than you might have been able to with like the Inkling going in for those forward airs. So yeah. we'll see how it comes out here. You got, you got the game to play with. Three, two, one, I also just love Seth's Yoshi, man. Seth it's nice. It's incredible. nice Yoshi. It was really fun to watch in the last game. And yeah, watch him in the Nintendo Open. That was good stuff. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You'll be able to move around set, move around Dire Shield a whole lot more as well, too, with those rising short hop nares. Yeah. I, I, that's one thing is that Yoshi's just got a lot more... He's a lot more threatening on shield. Yeah. He's, he's a very scramble-heavy character, and with how, how much trades they're go, they're taking in between every interaction, I can see how Seth would go for these trades yeah. with, uh, with Yoshi. Ooh. Getting caught throwing the eggs, though. That might be one thing that... Dyer could be punishing here these egg throws. Yeah, that's a new thing that I see. Oh, that was really high. good. Yeah, that up smash reaches high up. Yeah. Uh, something I've been seeing Wolves do a lot more recently is going for the forward air to back air. Yep. At the ledge, uh, Zachary did a lot of Genesis. And I don't want to say that he made it, but I feel like he popularized it. it. Yeah. Right. So um, it's really good too. Daybreak has a lot of kills. Dyer almost got one just there. Back but throw Seth again? gets no. the first stock. So. Ooh, oh, the tech God, chase I off forward that. throw. That was awesome. Yeah, he covered. He covered uh, neutral it, attack. He yeah. covered tech in. He covered tech. He covered neutral get up. He covered get up attack. Yeah, because he jumped over him first, yeah. so like we would have teched away. That was just that was really brilliant. good coverage. Wolf's down smash is one of possibly his scariest moves. He's got a lot of scary moves, but yeah, hits up there. Yeah, it's it's so much knockback, and it's like really hard to punish. Also, comes out pretty fast. Reverse nair to dash attack. There's there's a the back throw that we were talking about. Yeah. See, yeah, seeing it come out a lot of these hyper, these, these like mid percents where it wouldn't really kill. Yeah. Oh, nice. caught the jump out option of the egg. Not gonna die for it. Yeah. Squeezes a back air in there. If you drop off of the platform and do a back air with Wolf, it comes out just right perfectly before oh. you hit the ground. I feel like Seth kind of bet the house on him and him hitting that read and it killing. Yeah. And it was it was a great read to go for too. Perfect time to do it. It just didn't have enough juice in the tank. Great parry though. Gonna get the nair out of shield. One of the great things about Yoshi is you can't get shield poked, so. Right, I was just talking about that earlier. Yeah. Um, this is the most frustrating thing about playing against Wolf, is that the game feels so close, but as soon as he gets a lead, he it's just all lasers. Like, Ooh. all of the damage that Seth has taken the stock is from like lasers and six or seven lasers, yeah. yeah. And now he's at 70%. Trying to get that uh, that down air out of the egg pop-up, knowing as he's at lower percents, he will not be in the egg longer. Uh, he will not be in the egg as long. Yeah, Seth is a master of knowing yeah. exactly uh, that mash time and everything. Yeah. Trying to read the tech there though, drifting with the nair, but we slid Dyer get the grab on the platform. Go for the up throw. That, uh, didn't, that was like you in, saw in the you saw Seth said huh in the soles of his shoes. He yeah. back here. He hit his chakra. <laughs> yeah, really. Yeah, really. Just his, his chi. His uh. Wow. Right there you go. What